Established in 1953 as a small credit union for New York telephone company employees, today Capcom has more than 116,000 members attracted by its commitment to service, both to members and to the community. Believe it or not, I've been with Capcom since July 7, 1980. I started as a membership officer. There were nine of us. We had $28 million in assets. Today I'm the president. Um, we have three and a half billion dollars in our business holdings. The 2003 formation of the Capcom Cares Foundation allowed the organization to do even more, focusing their support on health and wellness, financial literacy, educational programs, and providing opportunities for children and underprivileged families. I love some of the work that we've done with St. Catherine Center and, and Marillac Homeless Shelter. I love the Running Start program with the Y. I love our Northern Rivers programs with our children. 85% of our employees and 100% of our volunteer board of directors physically volunteered through our Capcom Cares Foundation last year. They all get their hands dirty. They are seeing and feeling and believing in our mission. They have donated nearly $3 million and more than 30,000 volunteer hours to more than 250 community organizations, and they're just getting started. I can talk to you about programs out at um, Wildwood Camps where you know, the children are going to this beautiful camp in the Heldebergs, but they had to go into these trailers that had um, plywood for floors because otherwise you'd fall through them. Capcom made a visit and uh, we went home and changed that that afternoon. But it's so much more than just a check. We're there with them every step of the way. We're ensuring they have the opportunity to experience the beauty in life and they have the tools they need to succeed. 